I'm here with the match winner, Jamie Doyle, a last gas winner for Longford Town tonight uh, to defeat Wexford U and Wexford FC by a goal to nil. Jamie, incredible scenes on that goal, I think. Oh yeah, just delight. It's delight for the team more than that, you know, we worked very hard tonight. We thought we weren't going to break them down, but eventually in the end we got there. I was delighted to get the goal myself, you know, I needed that. And you're only on the pitch 10 minutes and yet you had, I think, two cleared off the line, two headed chances. And then you have the composure in the last minute to take a touch and, and lift it over the goalkeeper. Your heart must have been in your mouth waiting for that ball across the line. Yeah, stop. I felt like it was going in forever, you know. It was a great ball by Dean Zamber to see me, you know. All the extra players went to Dean Burns if he was going to get it. And I just luckily got a touch and slapped it in, you know. Of course, everyone's going to be talking about your finish, but I think uh, Dean Zamber deserves a huge amount of credit. It's the last minute of a game. It's been one of them nights where the ball just won't go in the net. He could have easily just said, I'm going to have a whack and hope this goes in. Instead, he keeps his composure, he looks up, he sees you, trips it through to you and, and you get the winning goal. Yeah, unbelievable composure by Dean, Dean Zambra, you know. He has that in the locker, so he's a good captain and he just kept plugging away and found a great ball for me, you know. That's why he's the captain, and, you know. And you mentioned the fact you needed a goal. Obviously, it's been a frustrating time for yourself and we've spoken before on the, the Longford SoundCloud account about maybe your lack of opportunities this season. I'm sure you're, you're looking to send a message now and hopefully get a run of games under your belt and score more big goals like that. Yeah, look, I'm disappointed the amount of game time I've got this year, you know, but i just got to keep working hard and training and hopefully Neil gives me the opportunity, you know, so I've done well for the team tonight and I'll just continue to do that and everyone give them the chance. Mm. Shelburne with a narrow 1-0 win over Bray today at the Carlisle grounds. Um, Bray, I think that most people would agree their season not going the way many would expect it. For Longford now, they're a point behind Shelburne before that game away to Bray next week, last game before the mid-season break. It's a huge opportunity for Longford now to maybe finish uh, up before the break, top of the league, or at the very least be right on top of Shelburne. Yeah, it's a massive game next week. We needed to win tonight for sure, and going to Bray next week, we must win, get three points next week to keep toes at shells, you know. So we'll do our rest next week and hopefully get the three points. <laughs>